Wingman by Butch Customs. A very fast and maneuverable shape that carries a lot of speed and is geared for a rider looking for a little more compact design. The rocker line of the Wingman is a very flat tail with a slightly turned up nose, uh, allowing the board to be very fast down the line. You'll notice that the uh, thickness profile of the board is slightly wider through uh, the center of the board. Uh, what this allows us to do is generate a little bit more buoyancy and lift um, while allowing the overall uh, length of the board to be shortened a bit. The great part about this is it creates a lot of maneuverability for a rider. Um, also allows you to uh, kind of size down the shape if you're, uh, if you're looking for a board that's very responsive. One thing we wanted to do with the Wingman that Butch uh, shaped into this board is um, make it so it was a little bit more responsive to a, a rider's needs. Uh, while the Wingman still has a wider tail and creates a lot of lift and drive, uh, it also has this nice kind of sculpted wing design with a swallowtail. Uh, what this allows the board to do is be much more responsive to a rider's back foot pressure. You then transition to the bottom of the board and you'll notice this uh, dual channel exit right past uh, kind of our new uh, center trailer fin configuration. This series features a quad fin setup. Uh, the great part about the quad fin setup is it gives you a little flexibility depending on what style of ride you're looking for. Uh, if you're looking for something a little bit more surf inspired, a little bit looser, you can just run it as a twin fin setup. Uh, if you do keep the rear trailer fins in, you get a little bit more bite and a little more tracking off that back foot. Uh, so really it comes down to uh, the style of ride you're looking for. The cool part about the Wingman is it also features FCS2 fin plugs. So um, this is a toolless system. Uh, all you do is you pop the fins in, lock them into place, and they're good. Uh, you can seat these down with the added uh, Allen key and um, set screws that come with the board, but overall designed to be a, a toolless system. On the top of the board, you'll notice a full corduroy finish machined EVA traction pad. Uh, the great part about the corduroy finish is it gives you all the grip of other traction, um, but it's not as noticeable underfoot. We finished it off with a uh, nice rear kick tail just so you can spot that back foot. The Wingman series features full hand laid up epoxy construction. The really cool part about epoxy construction is it's very similar to a lot of the high end ocean surfboards. It provides the rider a lot of that rigid, um, more responsive feel underfoot that many surf athletes are looking for. So that does it for the new Wingman. Uh, this is a great compact shape, drives a lot of speed, but uh, is a very, very maneuverable option.